Have you ever scrolled through Instagram, seeing those picture-perfect lives of billionaires with their private jets and luxury yachts and wondered, how did they get there? You know, the ones sipping cocktails on a beach in Bali while you're stuck in traffic on your way to work? While that's true in some cases, the reality is most billionaires built their wealth from the ground up. These individuals, they think differently. They operate by a different set of rules, a blueprint for success that most people just don't know about. And that's what we're diving into today. We're going to break down the top six rules billionaires live by, the ones that help them amass their fortunes. So buckle up, because this is going to be interesting. Rule number one is to think long-term. Now this sounds simple enough, right? But trust me, it's easier said than done. We live in a world obsessed with instant gratification, get rich quick schemes, overnight success stories. But billionaires, they don't buy into the hype. They understand that real wealth, lasting wealth, is built brick by brick, decision by decision, over years and even decades. Think about Warren Buffett. The guy's a legend, right? He started investing when he was just a kid, 11 years old, delivering newspapers. But it wasn't until he was in his 50s that he became a billionaire. That's decades of discipline, of ignoring the noise, of playing the long game. And that's what separates the billionaires from the rest of us. They're not looking for the next big stock tip or the latest crypto craze. They're building businesses, investing in real estate, creating things that will generate wealth for years, even generations to come. They understand the power of compound interest, not just with money, but with knowledge, with relationships, with everything. It's like planting a tree. You don't plant a seed today and expect a giant oak tree tomorrow. It takes time, it takes nurturing, it takes weathering a few storms along the way, but eventually that little seed grows into something strong, something that provides shade, something that lasts. And that's what long-term thinking is all about. It's about delaying gratification today for exponential rewards tomorrow. It's about focusing on the process, not just the outcome. They play the long game. Let's face it, none of us can do it all alone. We all have our strengths and weaknesses and billionaires, they get this. They understand that their time is valuable and they're not afraid to delegate tasks to others who can do them better, faster, or more efficiently. Think about Richard Branson. The guy runs over 400 companies. Do you think he's personally involved in every single one? Of course not. He's built a team of experts, people who are passionate and knowledgeable in their respective fields, and he trusts them to handle the day-to-day -day operations. This frees him up to focus on the big picture, on strategy, on innovation. He's not bogged down by the minutia because he's leveraged the time and skills of others. And that's a crucial lesson for anyone looking to build wealth. You don't need to be an expert in everything. In fact, trying to be a jack of all trades will only spread you thin and limit your potential. Instead, focus on your strengths, on what you're passionate about, and delegate the rest. The key is to surround yourself with people who are smarter than you in certain areas and who can help you achieve your goals faster. Remember, you're the CEO of your own life. Leveraging other people's time and skills isn't about being lazy. It's about being strategic. It's about maximizing your own productivity and focusing on the tasks that truly move the needle. They build teams. Where things get interesting, Billionaires, they're not afraid to take risks. But here's the key, they're calculated risks. They don't just throw money at any shiny object that comes along. They do their research, they analyze the potential downsides, and they make informed decisions based on the information they have. Think about Elon Musk. The guy's a risk-taking machine. He poured almost all his money from the sale of PayPal into Tesla and SpaceX. These were companies on the brink considered incredibly risky by most investors. But Musk, he saw the potential, he believed in the vision, and he was willing to bet big on himself and his ideas. And look at him now. Tesla is revolutionizing the automotive industry, and SpaceX is pushing the boundaries of space exploration. These were risky bets that paid off big time. But it wasn't just luck, it was calculated risk taking. Now I'm not saying you should go out and bet your life savings on the next big thing, but what I am saying is that you need to be willing to step outside of your comfort zone to take calculated risks that have the potential for high rewards. This could mean investing in yourself, starting that business you've always dreamed of, or even just negotiating a higher salary. The point is, if you're not taking any risks, you're not growing. And if you're not growing, you're falling behind. Of course, not every risk will pay off. In fact, you should expect to fail sometimes, but that's part of the process. Billionaires, they're not afraid of failure. They see it as a learning opportunity. 
obsess over innovation and improvement. Billionaires, they're not content with the status quo. They're constantly pushing the boundaries, looking for ways to do things better, faster, and more efficiently. They're obsessed with innovation and improvement. Think about Steve Jobs. He didn't just want to make another computer. He wanted to create something that would change the world. And he did. The iPhone wasn't just a phone. It was a revolution. It changed the way we communicate, consume information, and interact with the world around us. And that's what separates the billionaires from the rest. They're not afraid to challenge the norm, to disrupt industries, to create something truly innovative. They understand that in today's fast-paced world, if you're not innovating, you're falling behind. This applies to every aspect of their lives, from their businesses to their personal lives. They're always looking for ways to optimize, to streamline, to improve. They're constantly asking themselves, how can I do this better? And this isn't just about creating the next billion dollar product. It's about constantly seeking ways to add value, to solve problems, to make things better for everyone. It's about having a growth mindset, always striving to learn and improve. The world is changing at an unprecedented pace, and those who are adaptable, who are constantly innovating and improving, will be the ones who thrive. Chapter five, focus on value creation, not just money. Here's a secret. Billionaires, they're not actually obsessed with money. I know it sounds counterintuitive, right? But hear me out. They understand that money is simply a byproduct of value creation. Their focus is on solving problems, on making a difference, on creating something that people need and want. Think about Bill Gates. He didn't build Microsoft just to become rich. He wanted to make computers accessible to everyone. He wanted to empower people with technology, and in doing so, he created one of the most valuable companies in the world. The same goes for any successful entrepreneur or investor. They're not just chasing dollar signs, they're passionate about their work, about the impact they're making, about the value they're creating, and that's a crucial distinction. When you're solely focused on making money, it becomes a lot harder to achieve true success. Six, never stop learning. The final rule, and perhaps the most important one, is to never stop learning. Billionaires, they're voracious learners. They're constantly reading, attending conferences, networking with other successful people, and expanding their knowledge base. Think about Warren Buffett. The guy's a reading machine. He spends the majority of his day reading, and he credits much of his success to his love of learning. And it's not just him. Mark Cuban, Elon Musk, Oprah Winfrey, all these incredibly successful people are lifelong learners. They understand that the world is constantly changing. And to stay ahead of the curve, they need to be constantly evolving as well. They're not afraid to admit what they don't know, and they're always eager to learn from others. So what are you doing to expand your knowledge and skills? Are you reading books and articles in your field? Are you attending industry events? Are you seeking out mentors and advisors who can help you grow? In today's fast-paced world, learning is no longer a luxury. It's a necessity. The more you learn, the more valuable you become. The more skills you acquire, the more opportunities will open up to you. So there you have it. The top six rules billionaires live by. These aren't just random tips or tricks. They're fundamental principles that can transform your life and your finances. Remember, building wealth isn't just about working hard. It's about working smart. It's about adopting the right mindset, developing the right habits, and surrounding yourself with the right people. So which of these rules resonated with you the most? What's one action step you can take today to start implementing these principles into your own life? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more videos on building wealth, achieving success, and living your best life.